best hospital in town. <laughs> Trust me, General King does not have good food. It's all liquid, you know. But God is good, isn't he? How many come to worship him? Amen. How many come to praise his name this morning? Amen. Are you ready to receive something? Amen. In order to receive something, first you must give him praise, give him glory, and give him honor. Father God, we're so thankful. God, for this time, Lord, that we have to be in your presence, God. We ask you, Lord, that you just come by, God, in a very special way in this service this morning, God. Let the anointing fall in Jesus' name. I'm gonna walk all around that city Where the loved ones is gonna be Oh, I'm blessed beyond 
believe in doing what the Bible says around here. Is there any sick among you? Let them call the elders of the church to pray. Let them anoint him with oil in the name of the Lord. If you need a touch in your physical body, if you need a touch in your marriage, you need a touch in your family, I want you to come. Quit becoming victims of the devil all week long. God's saying, I want to set you free. I want to give you help today in the power of the Holy Ghost. Oh, yeah, way maker. Jesus. 
Spirit, I want you to start praying in the Holy Ghost right now. Right now, in the name of Jesus, every shackle, every stronghold, be broken in the name of Jesus. Let's link our faith together. We're believing God for some impossibilities to become possible today. We're believing God for some spiritual, some financial, some emotional breakthroughs today. We didn't come here for a religious routine. We didn't come here out of habit. We didn't come here because we didn't have some else. I come to experience the power of the Holy Ghost. I come to experience His victory. I come to experience His presence. I come to experience the power of His resurrection this morning. Yes, I be. Yes, I be. me too. 
today. Get it off of your shoulders and confess it to me today, says the Lord. Leave here free from that weight of sin. Leave here free from that weight of addiction. I'm here to free you today, says the Lord of hosts. If you're here today and you've been carrying around a weight of whatever it may be, a weight of sin, a weight of addiction, maybe it's a secret addiction. If you can believe God, I believe he can set you free today. I don't, I don't care, this ain't my show. I said, this ain't my show, this ain't your show. We're here for the king. Oh God, break our hearts for you, Lord. Break our hearts for you, Lord. Break our hearts for you.
Uh, let's give our singers a hand this morning. Praise the Lord. All right. I don't know about you. I can leave right now and say, I've had church today. Praise the Lord. If you didn't, that's on you. Shame on you. Amen. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving in your hearts. Enter into his courts with praise. Amen. This is a day that the Lord has made. You've got a choice to rejoice and be glad in it or get mad in it. Amen. That's up to you. But let's give the Lord one more hand clap of praise. You can be seated this morning in the presence of the Lord. We're so thankful and grateful uh, for everyone that is uh, here today. I'm so glad to see uh, Sister uh, Dina's husband, John, here today. John is a uh, truck driver, and uh, so a lot of times he is a... Uh, on the road, but I'm so glad you're here today. Say, so, Lord bless you. And of course, your son, Brexton. Brexton. You got, hey, easy on me, Brenton. Don't get mad at me, bro. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Now, it takes me a couple times. I think I, the first, uh, I think whenever I did y'all's wedding, I think I called you Jeff, right? <laughs> right after I got y'all married. So, praise you. At least I didn't say that during the ceremony or Dina be married to somebody named Jeff. All right. But uh, we're so glad everyone uh, is here today. And uh, we say the Lord bless you. I'm glad Sister Bridget's able to be here this morning. Got to run into her Costco last night. And, uh, I'm so glad for everyone uh, that is here. Bridget, you've got a friend with you, it looks like? Or? Yes, yeah, this is my friend Eva from Eva. All right. Oh, well, Eva, we're so glad you're here today. We said, Lord, bless you. And of course, everybody else, we're so thankful for everyone that is here. I'm glad, uh, I'm glad little Kyson's back, and I'm glad Paul is back. Amen. Praise the Lord. Uh, I said, Paul and uh, Kyson, I'm so glad they're here. <laughs> And Hannah, I'm just kidding, we love you. Uh, praise the Lord. At this time, we're going to take up our Penny March. Sister Diane, why don't you come? Uh, at Penny March today is going towards our missionary to Uganda, Brother Patrick. All right, and he will be here uh, tonight. Yeah, Heavenly Father, we thank you for Brother Patrick and his ministry, God. In Uganda, Lord, that we can help support. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Jesus loves little children. All the children of the world. Red and yellow, black and white. They are precious in your sight. Jesus loves little children of the world. Jesus died for all the children. All the children of the world. Time, uh, I'm going to ask if Brother uh, Rick and Brother Wayne could come uh, collect our Sunday morning uh, offering. And as they're making their way uh, up here, I'll make a couple of announcements. If you've got a cell phone, turn it off, all right, or on silent. That way uh, we don't get any disruptions uh, during the word. And uh, also, church tonight at 5, we're going to be doing a prophecy update, all right? So this will not be available on YouTube. It uh, will not be available on Facebook Live. We got flagged at our last prophecy update, and they told Brother Charlie, who runs it, they said, if you, you got one strike and uh, two more strikes, and they delete all of our history of videos, thousands of videos that this church has on YouTube. So they censored out the last prophecy update, too. If you watch it, they silence your voice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Amen. We were founded a Christian nation, yeah. but don't mean we still are. Hello, a Christian nation. I'm going to save this for tonight. Praise the Lord. I'm going to get going to get censored right now. All right. So praise the Lord. But uh, remember tonight, 5 o'clock, uh, Wednesday night at 6, Sister Linda is going to be speaking. <laughs> I was like, there she is. All right. Linda's going to be speaking on Wednesday, so be looking forward to that. Church Christmas dinner is going to be? Um, December 16th. December 16th. Money is due today. If you don't get paid till like a little bit later, you see me after church and you let me know, that's fine. But I'm going to text them tomorrow and give them a head count. So I really need to know how many is coming so they can start preparing for our event. 
Yes, so just let Sister Miranda know that. Next Sunday, the Grinch is coming to New Hope Church. All right. So, the Grinch is definitely going to be grouchy, but let's try to get him converted. Let's try to let's try to make him serve the Lord. He's, he's been grouchy for a long time. He needs the joy of the Lord. So, remember next Sunday, the Grinch will be here. If you've got friends and family, invite them. Uh, there'll be a photo booth to take pictures with the Grinch after church. Uh, and uh, we're going to have a wonderful, wonderful time. The kids will be in next Sunday, but it is going to be... A, it is going to be a special, special service that you don't want to miss, I promise you. So uh, don't forget that. Uh, and uh, Brother Rick, the seniors are going to be meeting. Yes, we have the seniors going to be meeting at our house next Sunday. Next Sunday afternoon after church, there is a sun up list back there. I know it's late getting there, but maybe right on that, what you want to bring. And, you know, let's say if you're 50 and up. All right. If you guys want to come, come and fellowship with us. Well, speaking of Brother Justin, he's going to be ministering for us next Sunday night. All right, so we looking forward to that, and uh, you're in for a very special, uh, special treat. So uh, be looking forward to that. One thing Brother Justin's told me is that, Pastor, I feel the call to one day be a pastor myself, and I said, I love hearing that. And I said, I, I will do everything I can to help play a part. Amen. And, and, and your growth and your development. Amen. So uh, praise your Lord. He's going to be ministering for us next Sunday night. So be looking forward to that. All right. Let us pray. Father, we thank you, Lord, for this time we can come to you in our giving. Yes, Lord, you bless this offering. And Lord, once again, I'm so thankful uh, that Brother Rick is here today. Lord, last Sunday he was laying in the hospital, but... Here he is today, worshiping you, taking up the offering, serving in your kingdom like you've called him to do. Continue to bless him, touch his health. In Jesus' name, and everybody said, Amen. 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 Oh, 
Sister Jennifer, tell the church how great your husband is. Amen. Amen. 